Hey, Phantom Maniacs, welcome to the newest unboxing here on the Needless Things YouTube channel. Today, we are taking a look at Profit Director Destro from the G.I. Joe Classified series. Obviously, this box stands out. He was, I don't know that you can call this an exclusive because it was available in so many different places, but he's not a mass market retail item, which is a little weird because he is numbered 15 in the line, so he is part of the regular series. Uh, it's very odd how they're doing the numbering and the, the special figures in this line, but whatever the case, he's got this nice gold foil uh, lettering and numbering on here. You can see the window box, as always, reveals the figure and the accessories. Looks very classy and nice. And then we've got the really the wildest art we've seen yet in this line, but I like it because he is such a gimmicky specialty type figure. Uh, I'm thrilled that Hasbro did something this fun this early in the line. Uh, to me, this says that the sky is the limit for these kinds of uh, repaints, retooling, whatever uh, alternate type figures. I say retooling. <laughs> I don't believe there's any retooling here, but we do have some new accessories that we're going to take a look at. Uh, on the side, we can see that Profit, Director's De Profit Director Destro's specialties are tools, bullets, money, and anvils. Uh, and of course, go right on over to GIJoe.com to see what all of those uh, graphics, those symbols actually represent. Uh, the back of the box, we've got the same regular uh, art, which I love this art. But why not do something a little different for this guy, since the rest of his box is so unique? Why not do something special on the back? Uh, but I realize with Profit Director Destro, you could probably get into sketchy te uh, territory with something like that. So maybe best just to leave us with the uh, regular box art, the, the tried and true box art that we've got right here. So I uh, like this gold foil Cobra on the top here as well. Very nice. Very nice. All right. Uh, even though to me, Destro is not Cobra, he is Mars, but that's something we'll get into maybe on the audible interlude GI Joe podcast, which you should check out the first Monday of every month. All right. Let's slice right through that tape and see what is inside other than this legally required piece of paper. We've got a few different items here. Uh, I noticed the larger pistol that the regular release Destro included is not in here. And that's okay because this guy has a few extra items that we're going to be taking a look at in just a minute. So we have the gold head Destro with the gold uh, necklace. I noticed the pendant is still... Uh, that silver color, but everything else here, we've got this nice gold going on. And the leopard print, if you take a look, or cheetah print, if you prefer, is very detailed. It's not just spots. There's actually a lot of color. It's a pretty thorough deco going on in the collar there. But then down on the pants, let's pull this. That looks uncomfortable. Sorry, James. Let's pull that down just a little bit. There we go. Let's get that belt about where it's supposed to be sitting, I think. Uh, on the pants, we have a little bit of a simpler print, but that's okay because this is not, it's not like outlandishly uh, different or, or, or cheap looking. It just looks like it's a different part of the same uh, <laughs> costume, outfit, uh, Saturday night special attire. I don't know. I don't know what we're looking at here. Um, he's got the gold rockets on his gauntlets. Uh, completely the same construction as the standard release Destro figure, just done in these uh, wild, garish colors. Uh, I like the black eyes there with the gloss on them. Looks really nice. And, of course, all the same articulation you see throughout this line, the butterfly joints, uh, the non-cut joint, the more of a ball joint type waist. He's got his belt, his holster, uh, double-jointed knees. And I like this deco here where we've actually got sort of a knee pad thing going on. It does still look like it's part of the, the pants, but it, it brings it out. It gives it a little more color, breaks it up a little bit. And of course, the gold toe on the boots there looks great. Very nice. I like the figure. 
Uh, he's obviously eye-catching, and to me, something that I want to have on the shelf, like I said, just to show how much fun the Classified series really is. Uh, as far as his accessories go, he's got a golden version of the same attache uh, briefcase, whatever you want to call it, that came with the regular release. He's got the nice Cobra sculpted on both sides there. Now, there was paint on the other one. I'm okay with this being all gold because if the red paint was on here, uh, you know, I don't, I don't know how great that would look. This should open up. There we go. Opens up to reveal dollar dollar bills and a little laptop that would be extremely difficult to work on with the keys recessed into the briefcase like that. But, uh, I like it. Got a little red Cobra logo, uh, the metallic sort of glossy screen there. Looks like there's actually something going on. And if you wanted to, you could, of course, store the pistol in that briefcase, but it's unnecessary because he has a functional holster. Uh, the pistol itself looks great. It's a weird sort of revolver type thing. I like this design. It's unique. It's interesting. I prefer this to just a regular old pistol. This looks like it might be another one based on a Nerf gun, and if so... That's fine with me. That doesn't bother me a bit. And that pistol, of course, goes right into Destro's right hand. Finger goes right into that trigger guard, sort of, maybe, a little bit. There we go. Uh, finger right into the trigger guard, holds it securely, looks great. Or stores right in that holster. Very nice. Well done. Uh, and then we have, oh, I almost forgot, the burning money. Very important because this is a unique accessory uh, to come with this figure. And Destro, you can just slot that burning money right into that hand right there. Because he is the profit distributor. And uh, he, he does what he wants with the money he has. Uh, all right. And finally, we have his little cape here. What profit director would be complete without a cape? With oh, Okay, that's, that was just a little schmutz on it there that came right off. Uh, now, you'll notice that the cheetah slash leopard print, which is actually a skin, which is really weird, uh, matches what's on his collar there. I like that a lot. Uh, you can see there's the red cape underneath with the skin on top. The fur trim looks really good. It's actually got the paws right here. And then the clasp with the gold uh, deco on that uh, just looks really actually kind of grotesque. I think that maybe actually putting the, the tail, which, which why is there like a half rat tail on this thing? This is bizarre too. Um, I think putting the feet and the tail or the paws and the tail on this was, was maybe going a little too far. It's a bit much. Um, this is, might be a little tricky to get on here around his collar. I'm not quite sure how that's supposed to, Oh, okay. The collar is pretty flexible. So that just goes right under there. Easy enough. And there you have, the completed look of Profit Director Destro. Wow. That is something else. Let's give him his briefcase here, too, to get the uh, the full effect, if you will. Uh, notice he's got a trigger finger on his left hand as well. So uh, he can hold that pistol in either hand and look good doing it. So this guy is ready to direct some profits and pres presumably smack up some iron grenadiers if they get out of line he's just looking right in there and saying you better have my money right uh i like it it's fun it's not honestly a necessary part of your gi joe classified collection but i like stuff like this so for me i think hasbro nailed it and did a great job thanks for watching please like subscribe share and stay tuned for more unboxing videos here on the Needless Things YouTube channel. Minute. The heck is? <laughs> I totally missed his sunglasses. <laughs>
Oops. All right, there we go. Ooh, those are giant. But they do complete the look. There we go. Complete. PD Destro. Very nice.